Hi guys, it's Krista from Playing With A Purpose and today I'm gonna to share with you a Dollar Tree haul. If you're new here, my name is Krista and I'm a childcare provider for up to five children. And on my channel, you'll find tips and tricks, all things related to childcare, shopping hauls, and the odd family blog. Before I get started with my Dollar Tree haul, I wanted to show you one item I picked up at the Dollarama. I got these super cool paint sticks. These seem to be super popular in classrooms in the last year or so, and I was so excited to find them at my local Dollarama. Let me just pull one out really quick and we'll see if it works. So this is what they look like. And so the cap just comes off like this, and then you can turn them up. So yes, they work very well. And for $4, I think this is a great find at your local Dollarama. I think this is gonna be a great new art medium for your classroom. My husband's a beekeeper, and so I'm always partial to different honey-related items. And this super cute honeycomb ceramic container was at the Dollar Tree. So I thought I'd pick this up. For my dramatic play area, I, I found these super cute little faux leather purses. I picked up a pink and a black, but they had gray as well. I found these great Tonka stickers. They're super puffy and I thought they were super cute. And we're hoping to do a transportation theme this year, so those are gonna be great. And I also got these great fish stickers. I got these super cute LED pumpkin tea lights. Many of you know that at Christmas time, I like to partner with an organization called Operation Christmas Child. And what you do is you fill up a shoe box full of different items for a child in need around the world. And so I picked up a couple of really cute Barbie toothbrushes. I also found these amazing Lego containers. So basically you get the container that holds all the different little bricks and then the lid is a building surface. And so this is perfect for the Operation Christmas Child boxes. I can easily stuff the inside of the container full of little bricks and then they'll have a nice building surface to go along with it. So the storage and everything all in one. So I picked up two of these. They also say containers for drinking is also a great idea. So I thought it would be really cute to add some little Lego drinking cups. Of course, I had to grab a bunch of bricks as well to fill the container. I also picked up some little windows and doors as well as some little people. And I found these really cute little purses. I thought they were super cute. I love the little colors and they have little they have like a little play set inside so there's little clip hair clips and a little perfume bottle and some bracelets so i grabbed two of these i don't know if you've noticed around the stores but crayola came out with super cute unicorn chalk and i've seen them in a few different stores now and they're absolutely adorable and the dollar tree came out with their version of the unicorn chalk. It's absolutely amazing how Dollar Tree just seems to come out with all the newest trends and they are always paying attention to the latest and greatest. And I just was so surprised to see this unicorn chalk in the Dollar Tree. I also found these super cute cars. These cars look exactly like the green toys that are sold everywhere and I just I couldn't believe it. There was, I think there was three or four different colors. And so I grabbed a couple of these. I found a good old fashioned color by number. This is great for number recognition. And I have very young children. So I love that it was just using the numbers one to five. I will also add the color with a marker down here just to make it a little bit easier for the children to identify the numbers. But I thought this was a great find. And again, because it's numbers one to five, it's perfect. Sadly, I also grabbed a couple of little masks to have in my classroom in case anybody gets sick. Dollar Tree just came out with a whole new bunch of band-aids. And so I grabbed this one. I thought it was super cute, ocean themed band-aids. So I grabbed some of those. 
I also got this cute little bath book for my grandson. It's a Sesame Street called Growing Up Strong, and I thought it was super cute and perfect for his stocking. And the last thing I got were these little babies. These are super cute for young children, and I love that they're multicultural, and these are gonna be great for your sensory bins. I hope you enjoyed this haul. I'm Krista with Playing With Purpose. I'll see you next time.